Hello friends, welcome to Skill Core Writing. Today we can check uh, the return value of store procedure. If the store procedure execute, then it will returns an integer type value. Okay. So if the value is zero, that means it uh, the procedure executed successfully. If it is non zero, then maybe it will be an error. Okay, we can return the custom integer type also. Okay, we can just check. This is our table, customer table. Okay, so we are then just creating one small store procedure. Create a procedure, load customer, and we, dis we are displaying all data from the customer. Okay, so now we can just execute this query. I will show you. We will just execute this SP. We'll, we are getting the output. Okay. So, how to return the stop zero value? That we can declare one variable, declare that integer type value, and execute the return value equal to the procedure name. Your parameter is there, then we need to pass. Okay. This is a parameterless store procedure so we are not passing anything and uh, we are just displaying this return value here okay so now we can just execute this query okay now we can see uh, procedure executor after that uh, the return value is zero okay so the store procedure is successfully executed then the return value is uh, zero okay we can execute some custom custom integer value we can just try to return okay so that in that case we need to create one store procedure uh, usp get customer by country count so we are passing the country here and we are declaring one integer value and uh, we are assigning the count value of that country number of count, uh, number of rows count uh, we can we assign to this country count okay that we are trying to return okay so now we are just executing this query so we can check india one two three three records right so we will execute this query now we are getting the return value 3 because we are returning the country count here. okay so this this is the custom type of return value return value in the stop procedure okay next now we can try with the return with uh, some stream function string values okay so that that's why we are just declare the country name and uh, we are just check this country and we are assigning name to this country name so that time the country name will come here or customer name will come here right customer name will come here okay so we want country okay Just execute this. Now we will execute this. What is the output? Output will also India, right? So just check. Now we are returning the country name here okay we are returning the integer type uh, string type okay that will not permit so that's why this error okay conversion failed okay so the procedure will always return 
integer value. You can just try select error division by zero, one by zero. Okay, just execute this. We are passing India divider by zero encounter. So that time we will execute this query. Now the return value is minus six. Okay. Uh, returning the country name okay that will not allow to return integer type okay this is worker value okay so store procedure will always return integer value if value is zero that means it executed successfully uh, we can execute uh, return the customer custom type Zero values also okay, like this count or country ID, um, custom ID, or anything you can return okay. And uh, if it is uh, non zero, that means it is another okay, okay. Guys.